Man, what's up, y'all? We back on Hero Light TV 504. We downtown. We cross the canal right now. You know what I'm saying? All Night Shorty. If you don't know who All Night Shorty is, bust it. Bust it wide open, man. Y'all know that motherfucking smash shit. The legendary. Y'all know he dropped that fucking poke it out. Y'all know he dropped that motherfucking. You was on that money, uh, got me blind. You know the motherfucking cut up for me. You know I shot that fucking cut up for me. Everybody whipping out iPhone, taking a picture from a distance. I've been watching your move. Him and Big Diesel, you know that bitch went down. So just bucking from wall to wall. If you fake. Don't answer this roll call, me muggers. Don't start tripping in here, cause AK slugs could start flipping in here. Your whole thing, I get a ass whooping in here. Oh, man, y'all holler, holler at him all night, y'all. Let the people know what's up. Whoa, whoa, my dog, Mel Boy, Chuck, hey, why your TV, your day, we doing it, man. All night, you have to come through and show some love to my nigga. We've been grinding in the game for years, man. Right. Yeah, for, for years, like right after Katrina. When we was like one of the first to come back. He came back uptown first. I came back downtown, yeah. and and we just we just came here. We right. Came, we connected. Number Fire Records. Right. You know Six Wall Puck. Right. Rest in right. Six Wall Puck. Number Fire Records brought us together, and uh -huh. and, and from there we just been together though. Like you know. Like you know. Yeah. We've been together doing it. You know, working hard, man. Trying to you know put the work in that we need to put in to get where we need to be. You know. Man, and look, man, I'ma tell y'all this, man. I knew All Night Shorty before I knew All Night Shorty because I was a little nigga, you know, I'm bumping, I'm seeing everybody bust it over to this nigga song. So when I really met this nigga, this nigga look like you my motherfucking need. I'm like, man, look at this nigga here, man. This nigga like one of the realest niggas I ain't lying. Nigga really encountered in New Orleans. Like this nigga helped me with a lot of shit, like with this film shit that y'all watching right now. He supported this shit like since day one. When I met him, I wasn't filming. So when I got into him and Six Wall Pook, they was like one of the first niggas, like the first two niggas to show me love, like for real, for real. And by all that being said, since I met this nigga, he been on this grind from New Orleans, Baton Rouge, Houston, locally doing shows. So Very like, well. what's your advice to the local artists in New Orleans and all in the state of Louisiana coming up? Cause our rap industry is like no other. So what's your advice to all the upcoming artists right now in the game in Louisiana? My advice to every upcoming artist, bro, that's locally and listen to me and listen to me well, though. And hear me well, though, because I'm telling you from experience. Listen to me, bro. To every local artist, have your business in order, bro. You know what I'm saying? You can rap 95%, talent 100%. If your business not in order, that rap shit ain't gonna mean nothing. Because at the end of the day, it's 95% business and 5% talent. Think about it. Blueface Tatiana, he sound like he ain't much on beat. Right. But a nigga can't talk about it because it's working for him. You right. know what I'm saying? It's something, even though he took the little juice out of my out of my song. Right. And did what he did, it's working for him. It's just that the business part of it ain't in order. You know what I'm saying? Because you know the song that you originally got that from. Right. You ain't pay homage, right? You know, like 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 Beyonce pay homage to to Manny Fresh. He right. felt, felt underappreciated all uh, night. You know, feel yeah. the same way. So I tell every local artist, man, yeah. to have your business in order, man. Right. Because if you don't, you are gonna get screwed, homie. Right. So by you saying all that, like you you went through an experience with the business not being being in order, right? Yeah, I'm, I'm going through experiences right now. You know, right. litigations. Right. We got litigations with Warner's brothers. I got litigations, you know what I'm saying, with uh, Take Fu. Right. I got litigations with a lot of a, a lot of people in the industry because they didn't handle it on the business aspect of it, though. They didn't handle right. the business side of it. So, you know, therefore, I'm I'm take I'm not taking it in an action like it's nothing personal. Right. It's only business. Yeah. I'm not. I'm just taking it in a business aspect of it in a business manner to, to, to set out to get what I rightfully deserve. For my hard work, bro. You know what I'm saying? Right. And that's just that, you know, like. Yeah, simple. yeah. I know one thing, cause if you steal something from Melvin Boy, check all my shit. I won't mind too. Cause if you took it, man, all that short. If you would have took this shit, they'll be on your ass on that, you that right just now. Business, yeah. They'll be well, on that, you right now. Especially if it was a, especially if it was a song that did good, like right. if it was a song that made it. Right. You could be looking forward to some niggas' attorneys giving you a phone call, Believe or that. sending you a letter or yeah, something that like bitch that. Pop. You know what I'm saying? All right. Well, look. What new music they can expect from uh, All Night Shorty right now? What new music they got, you got coming all night? 
Oh man, y'all got to be on the lookout for the uh you know we got the uh the pop that thing new single dropping man we're gonna uh -oh. re-release bust it open all right all and, right um all we right. got uh we all got right. uh the club fetish album coming man i'm gonna get y'all that album club fetish yeah they've been and, waiting uh, on it now you gotta get it yeah and and um you know you know cut up for me we dropped that you know what i'm saying the latest thing mm -hmm. and um y'all check out the uh flex cypher with b speed man that thing right. blazing right now we just dropped that on youtube right you can type in b speed all night short and, 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 and figure them joints out Believe that way, well, y'all, man. We're gonna take a quick intermission. Y'all stay tuned. Here, YTV 504, baby. You dig? You dig? Cut up for me, hey, why your TV decides it's supposed to be done. Shout out to Cut Up. Cut up for me. It up against every wall in the room. She a dime piece, but her ass like that. Come a little closer, let me tap that fat. If she get it from her mama, she robbed all her sisters. Everybody whipping out iPhone, taking a picture. From a distance, I've been watching your move. Wonder how you make that booty, do what it do. Is that normal or do you make it wobble on purpose? Is that booty up in the circus before it hurt us? No, 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 let me take you home with me. And put the smack down on both of them cheeks. Oh, cut, cut, cut up for me. 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 Cut up. Everybody cut up. Let me see you cut up. Cut up. Everybody cut up. Now cut up. Bucking from wall to wall If you fake, don't answer this roll call Me muggers, don't start tripping in here Cause AK slugs could start flipping in here Your whole thing, I get a ass whooping in here We all white boy wasted in here Blacks, whites, also my amigos Got racks falling from the ceiling by the truck loads Every booty shaking, got dollars hanging from it Diesel time, fresh out the pen, tipping hundreds R.I.P. Kim Gross, corrupt cops killed you Every hood in the world, gotta feel you We cut up in the club like El Cotta on the plane We took the rough route to stack up our chains Now we out our mind, on the hard grind Buck wild forever, it's cut up time I want you cut up for me, cut up Cut up for me, cut up for me, cut up for me, cut up Everybody cut up, let me see you cut up Everybody.
Oh, 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 Roll up here. Man, man, we back on here by TV 504. I told y'all we downtown Park the Pinnell right now. We're all night nice shorty. Tupelo, Tupelo and Claybone. Tupelo and Claybone is where we at right now, man. I gotta bring you to the heart of the night. You know, T.I. came down here and shot a movie, and he named it Cut Through City, you hear me? But it wasn't pertaining to nothing that was in the hood. Right. If T.I. wanted to do a movie, you can come down here and get with the real inside of the hood. This cut through city. And, and this the real cut through. We can show CTC. them how to do the cut through city. They just got a link out to the general in the hood that's, that's still in the streets, you know what I'm saying? Holding it down and, 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 and put a nigga on, you know what I'm saying? This will be the stealing nigga shit, and though. That, that was, that, that's the whole thing of the topic, like, you know, like, if you link up with us and, and spread the love and everybody come together, you it know what I'm saying? It go better, though. It go all the way better because we, we know the ins and outs. You want to know about Katrina? You want to know what Katrina did? You want to know what people died at and what, it, what, what the high rent it was down here? All the dramatic drama and all that, the action. You know, get through the general. Come through me. Come through my old boy Chuck. Right. Get in contact with somebody, dog, and, 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 and a nigga going to point you in the right direction off the dump. Man, and look. I was talking about Cutthroat City, and we, like we in the Nine Walls too, bro. This is a real action hot spot, and all the shit going on in New Orleans through the city, the juveniles is like you know the crime rate right up, but them it ain't even the old niggas no more. So by you being an OG all night, shorty, you just did your time in the penitentiary. <coughs> you know what I'm saying? What advice you got to the young niggas? You know, it's in some of them, and you know, some of them just perpetrating. What's your advice to the young niggas though committing all these fucking crimes through the city that just got there hot, hot, hot for no reason? Man, listen, I'm not going to bash and bash you the youngsters. I'm going to tell them that okay. I understand. Yeah. And listen, I, listen, Chuck, and this real talk, and I'm glad you spoke upon that topic, though, because, you know, right now, bro, the way the world going on and the thing that's going on with the youngsters, all I can tell them is I understand because half of the politics and the police officers don't understand is when you ain't got no food in your house, you hear me? Or when the lights not on, or when the lights on and the water not on, or the water not on and the lights on, and your little sister need pampers, and things is hard, and you young and can't get a job, and they ain't got nobody providing jobs, you gotta wait all the way to the summer, and then you going to school and mom's struggling. You don't know the household might be broken. Mom right. might be on her own crack weed. Real. The same drugs that did let it to our community. Right, yeah, We ain't got no boats, we ain't got no planes. Real, we ain't got no. I'm letting them know I understand, but I'm also letting y'all know there's better ways to do things. Right. Like lashing out like a kid, acting out like you get mad at your mom, you catch temper tantrums, and you be on the streets around people, you catch temper tantrums, so you're killing them. Yeah. You, you need stuff, so you're yeah. robbing these people, you're doing it to your own people. Cause you don't understand the extent of what you're doing and what they gonna do and what they gonna do to you and what they gonna lock you off at and you gonna have to do what they tell you to do. You gonna become a part of their secret society. Right. They making it to where you came up reach your family. If you ain't got no money, you hit. Right. Inside the inside that penitentiary. Real. Real. To my youngsters out there, bro. It's senseless. Right. You doing it to your own people. We don't have nothing, yo. We never had nothing. Right. We been sold everything we had. That's like breaking into an empty house, dog. There's still something and nothing in there. Right. You and you get caught. You doing it for nothing. So at the Real. end of the day, dog, like, you know, you can use... We got a lot of Nipsey hustles right here in the hood that just need to, you know, they need to step up a little more. You know what I'm saying? Right. A lot of our leaders left, left them youngsters because they feel like, I ain't fucking with them little niggas. I made my money. Boy, let them niggas kill each other up. Our, our, our old OGs got to step back up, our leaders, Real shit. they got to step back up, you know? Real shit. Real we, shit. We, ain't, we ain't stepping up for our youngsters. Right. That's like our parents young having kids. Right. They young having babies, they, they babies ruling them because they babies growing up to be bigger than them. Right. They getting scared of them. Real our shit. parents ain't never bow on us. So yeah. You can't bow on your child, you got to put that pressure. You got you to gotta guide your child in the right path. Right. And, and, and to the youngsters, bro, I understand. But, but 
You better pray to God and hope you change your mind before it's too late. And look, man, what about, like, you know, now, I'm gonna tell y'all, all night shorty, if y'all looking to the music, all night shorty make a lot of, a lot of turn up feel good music, but, he a street dude, like, all his life, like, you guys, anybody in the world, he from the streets, but, he don't really make no gangster music, and 90% of the niggas out, you know, one thing, they making gangster music, and half of the niggas never touch the streets, but, they influencing our little niggas so wrong, and the little niggas, they so blind to see that these niggas not who they say they is. So what, what, you, like, what, you, what, what you think about the niggas who leading our youngsters the wrong way and they not even living their life? Cause you a street nigga, but you just number party music. So what about the niggas who perpetrating their life, leading our youngsters the wrong way? And they never went that route, never got close to them. Man, listen. I don't rap, I don't that. rap gangster rap because I'm tired of the killing. Like, I nobody, like, when you got a, 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 a room full of women, you hear me? Don't nobody want to hear that gangster shit. Nigga come have fun. You know, a lot of, a lot of music, though, it's, it's not, a, they don't have a message. Like, a lot of rappers back in the game, they gave you a message in the rap. Like, you know, it had meaning to it. Like, right now, it's just about a beat and riding the wave and Trying to make a little money. putting something together, though, but you got to understand, this music really educates us. So if it's, if it's trash music, the world going to be trash. Right. Because of what you're teaching them. You ain't educating them. So how could you blame me for being lost? Right. You know, our Tupac's gone. Our Biggie's gone. Right. You know what I'm saying? We still got all this is that's educating. You feel me? But the world has changed with rap so much to where they sleeping on it. Right. They rather hear negative right. than knowledge. Right. That's just like it's so easy to so easy to do bad, but so hard to do good. Yeah. Um, you know, you got you got dudes spending that knowledge like Kendrick Lamar. Right. You know what I'm saying? You right. got you got rappers back in the game, Nas. You know what I'm saying? All these dudes, all these hip hop artists, they really spitting. Right. I could go on and on and on. Right. But their time is not like it was when they were spitting when people was really paying attention. Paying like attention, yeah. back in the days, Chuck, I could come knock, knock on your door and borrow some motherfucking sugar. Right. Time not like that now. Can't knock on niggas. So it's when crazy. they promote murder, 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 kill, 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 hustle on the corner, trap, 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 get it, get it, get it. What you think? What you think? I won't be like these niggas. I'm putting on my fake jewelry. I'm putting on my right. fake everything, and I'm going to get it. Right. You feel me? Right. That's what it is. I want to be this image. Right. So I don't create an image of of a of, of, of paint bad spirits. I teach my son TKL. He coming. He he, he an artist, but he educating in music. Right. He right. trying to bring positive energy. You right. know what I'm saying? That was up. Because if you rap a gangster, you kill it eventually, you gonna get killed. Right. Every rapper that rap gangster, what happened to him? Yeah. T.Y. Yeah. So Jeremy, slim. Soldier Slim. A lot of, a lot of I could go on and on and on because of the energy you bring in spirits. It's right. A spiritual world. Right. So until a nigga understand that, that's what it is. Right. 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 Man, I told y'all we crossed the canal right now. We're all night shorty. We fucking with the real right now, Mr. Busted Open. I told y'all. Original. Original Mr. Busted Open, you know what I'm saying? For real, for real. Y'all just stay tuned, stay intact. We're gonna be right back. Y'all enjoy this video. We on Hill TV 504. Busted Open.